name is Brittany and I'm a stylist with Lula Rose and today I'm going to show a half up bun with our U-pins. We have a lot of different types of U-pins. Um, I'm going to show off three different types in a half up bun just so you can see how the different ones um, look. They all go in basically the same but they look a little bit different. So I have a swerve here to show you. Um, the swerve comes in four different colors. Um, we also have some decorative ones, that beading up here, but this is just the plain um, flat one that I really like. And then I have one of our decorative sets. This is the Tudor Rose set. And then in my hair, I have a brand new Harmony U-pin. And I'm just gonna pull that out. That's the best part of wearing U-pins, is pulling them out and shaking your hair down like that. <laughs> um, I'm just going to brush my hair out real quick so I can do the half up bun. And this is actually a Lola Rose hairbrush as well. It's the one that I use every day. And I'm going to do a quick spritz of our rose water. This is made from steam distilled organic roses. It's really good for um, nourishing your hair, moisturizes it a little bit, but the biggest thing I use it for on my hair is um, frizz. It's a little bit humid today. My hair's trying to be a little crazy, so putting on a little bit. Also really good for your skin. So I'm just going to separate my hair out about halfway, all the way around. Um, you can make this a little bit more fancy by doing a braid with this part, but I'm just going to keep it simple today. So I'm just twisting it. You just want to make sure the twist is um, pretty tight, not super tight, but that's what the U-pins grab onto to secure the hair. So you want a decent twist. And then to put it in, you hold the U-pin backwards, so this is how it will end up. So you start with it this way. You catch part of your bun, and you come out, touch the tines to your head, and then turn it over and push it in. You want to catch the twist a little bit on the other side as well as you're pushing it in, and then go all the way as far as you would like there. So that is with the new Harmony U-Pin in, it has gem tones. I got the um, emerald color, because that's my birthstone. And then I will show you with a swerve. You can see these ones are shaped a little bit differently where the, the tines actually curve in towards each other. That actually creates a more secure hold, especially in fine hair. So again, for this one, you just want to catch the twist touch it to your head. Make sure it's in contact with your head as you turn it over. Catch a little bit of the twist on the other side. And then as you push this one in, you'll really feel it grabbing and tightening. So just something like that. Like I said, these ones are excellent for fine hair. Um, they do work well for, for ladies with lots of hair too, but I found that that little curve there just really helps it have a little extra grip. Okay, I'm gonna twist this back up because I keep I've loosened it up a little bit, taking the pins in and out. Um, I'm gonna twist it back up and then I will do the Tudor Rose set real quick. So for these, they are shorter and they come in sets so that you can put in two and that helps them hold a little bit better. But the, the set will, will hold anywhere from this little bit of hair like what I'm using or um, a lot of hair. You pins are very versatile as far as the amount of hair. Might wanna adjust the pins to hide them a little bit more if you want. But there you go. So three basic half up buns with U-pins, super easy to do. 
Um, I had my hair like that all day yesterday and I was doing housework, actually at someone else's house and chasing two toddlers at the same time. So very easy um, and you don't have to readjust it all day. So that's always a big plus for busy moms. <laughs> um, let me know if you try that and if you have any questions. Um, and I will put my link down in the description of the video as well if you want to check out Lola Rose's selection of U-pins because we have a beautiful and large selection. Thanks for watching! Mm -hmm.